music to get it on my head I remember that it even goes through your sin Never leave it, gonna up to you I don't hear my job, I said I went through Didn't wanna know what I brought you to But I find out what I could have been to You're being red, but it made me sick I'm just not wondering about it, can it break my head? Oh my gosh, what was that all about? Oh, so, uh, the other night, we had a huge windstorm rip through here. 45 knot sustained wind, 70 knot gusts, uh, three in the morning, everybody's out of their boats that's living down here. Everybody's on the dock. There's four foot waves breaking over the breakwater. Boats are leaping three to four feet, uh, fetching up against their dock lines. Uh, one boat ripped her cleats out of the deck and ended up sideways in the slip. But the cool thing is, uh, the community here really rallied that night. It was a huge act of solidarity between uh, the liveaboard community down here. Uh, everybody was rushing around with flashlights, fenders, spare lines, uh, having each other's backs. We worked our way down the dock as it was heaving and pitching with water breaking over it uh, in order to be there for the other people here in our little floating community, in our water tribe. So we're out there, three in the morning, uh, we're saving boats and we see this poor liveaboard. We find him uh, dragging his anchor and he's, and he's heading towards the rocks. Uh, so we find him uh, up on the beach, his boat's wrecked in a wash, uh, and we proceeded to spend the next couple days uh, trying to help him out. What had, uh, what had happened is uh, he hit the rocks and actually put a rock through the side of his hull, about the size of a basketball. The rock was half in, half out of his hull. Uh, so we spent a day running out anchors, running out every bit of spare line we had, uh, ran it to a nearby, uh, well, the closest pilot, uh, and used to come along in the, in the boat's winches to lean her up off that rock and get the rock out of the hull so we can move on to the next step. We're gonna keep helping this guy out. Next step, uh, we have some tractor inner tubes coming. He managed to find some really cheap tractor inner tubes and big truck tire inner tubes at a tire store on the mainland. And uh, we're gonna go ahead and fill the boat with those, pump them up full of air on the next low tide, uh, pump the water out of the boat, 
and hopefully get it to float enough to, to drag it to a soft beach uh, where we can then put it on the beach and begin making uh, some kind of repairs to the side of the hull. You know, the incredible part of this story is uh, just the act of solidarity, uh, the act of humanity during a crisis. I think that's the lesson to pass along to everybody here is uh, all we have is each other. There's nobody that's gonna be there for you like your neighbors, like we're strongest when we work together. When humans find a way uh, to work together, we're unstoppable. Our strength is in helping each other out. Our strength is in having each other's backs no matter who it is. But at the end of the day, we're all humans. We all deserve help. It doesn't matter if you caused your own problems, your own misery. I, I say we have those people's backs the most. We're all humans. We all mess up. We all fall down. Um, what makes us who we are is what we do after that. What we do for each other after that. After we fall down. And you know what I think? I think humans are pretty awesome. And find a way to be there for each other. Because that's who we are. That's who humanity is. I believe in us. I believe in you. Go be awesome.